Welcome to HDTV. You're now rocking with your boy. Now, Allen Iverson says something very important. Why am I not a part of the Philadelphia 76ers office? And you had some idiots on this sports page basically say, oh, because he don't know basketball. Like, are you kidding me? <laughs> Allen Iverson's one of the, he's the, he's the top, he is the fifth greatest player of all time to ever touch the court. His athleticism, his speed, his ability to hit the mid-range and to get to the to get to the paint was second to none. We haven't seen an Iverson since Isaiah. Isaiah Thomas was a better facilitator. AI was the better scorer. Now, Stephen. Now these guys. And he made a point. Michael Jordan should have had half, he should have owned half of the Bulls and potentially owned all of it. He should have at least been president of operations. But Ronsdorf didn't want that for him. Why is that? Allen Iverson told the truth. Why is it that the NBA superstar can't get a, a job in the front office which they carried the franchise but they'll give it to uh, John Paxson or they'll give it to a John Paxson Or they'll give it to a Jeff Hornacek. They'll give it to anybody who basically was a role player. They'll do that. They'll give it to probably the sorriest person on the bench. <laughs> they disrespect our black stars by saying, oh, the white mamba all that white mamba Scalabrini was a bum <laughs> as a ball player in the NBA not compared to people that's on the street he's better than them but as far as the NBA man Scalabrini was getting destroyed he barely got off the bench but this is how they do it they prop the little nerdy white kid to be the GM and all of this stuff he's able to get a job but the black man can't get a job Allen Iverson made the 76ers relevant since Charles Barkley left. When Barkley left, they had nobody there. AI came in there and destroyed. <laughs> Took it by storm. One of the first scoring guards we've ever seen. Scoring point guards at a high clip. But this is what it is. They don't care. They love this attention. They love to say, oh, well. Oh, well. You know, he's not that good. You know, his IQ, he couldn't play team basketball. Team basketball, he was the team. The hell is you talking about? Like people are so dumb. Allen Iverson was a he played team ball. He was running plays and sets, setting screens, getting the ball off the screen and roll, off the picks. He was doing what Steph Curry was doing and Reggie Miller, and that's why their team went to the championship because he was killing. He was out there balling. They never gave Allen Iverson a superstar, a guy who could play a counterpart of him. But yet, 
but yet everybody else can get all these teams, all these superstars on the team. Kobe had to beg to get Pau Gasol over there. Now, they were going to make Kobe a GM or a president of basketball operations, I believe. But Kobe said, hell no, I'm good. Give it to Rob Palenka. <laughs> Michael Jordan should have had ownership or part ownership of the Bulls. If it was not for him, the Bulls would not have been shit. Allen Iverson should have at least had a say in personnel in Philadelphia. That's Allen Iverson. And he doesn't get any respect because the league didn't like him because of what he brought. The tattoos, the brains. The tattoo and the braids. They hate it on him. They hate it on it. They hated it, they hated it, they hated it. Well, that's the problem. Excuse me. That's the problem. Dirk Nowitzki should have ownership. Paul Pierce should have some say in Boston. He stayed there and was loyal. But no. You stayed there, stayed loyal. Paul Pierce only had one championship. That's a travesty. Paul should at least won three. If his career started, if his career was different, like if he had different circumstances. Bro. Uh, what is you doing, bro? I'm about to crash. Now. Basically. Basically, you have to look at the whole picture and everything that's transpiring. The reason they don't want Iverson, excuse me, the reason they don't want Iverson as, um, what do I say, as, as any decision in the say is because they didn't like Allen Iverson as a player. They didn't like him. They did not like him at all. They did not like him at all. And plus, Allen Iverson was two against the grain. Excuse me. They don't bring Allen Iverson out like that because of his aura. His aura would trump anybody in that office. Michael Jordan's presence dwarfs everybody, including Kobe Bryant's. Why isn't AI there? Should be because he's not white enough. <laughs> he's not trying. If Allen Iverson would have cut his braids and never had tattoos, Allen Iverson would have been pushed as the greatest player ever, one of the greatest. But because he went against the grain and he was himself, the NBA hated that. could be in charge or even have a say in personnel. That's how it goes.
what you guys think? Do you guys think that um AI shouldn't have any say? I think he should have. If AI would have had say in anything, he would been he would he would have been drafting the right players. soft on everybody. You gotta be honest. They never support blacks. So, you know, it just gets... are now talking about Kyrie needs to take the, the, the vaccine. My thing is this. Excuse me. My thing is why a lot of stuff was happening that shouldn't have happened. start honoring the older players they need to start letting them get in these positions they try to hate on other people while praising one guy and it's a shame now they're blasting him oh he was the weakest link at the uh, place but yeah the thing is they gotta do better they got to They should all be playing. So, thank you for listening. Like, comment, subscribe, share this. Hit the notification bell to select all to receive upcoming notifications. And if you love what you hear, you can donate to the page by cash app me at the word welcome, the number two, and an HDI TV. We are having a stream yard tonight. It is on the top 10 women vocalists. Um, and it should be around Central Time. I'm not sure, but just be on the lookout. Um, we're finna do that tonight. And um, much appreciation. We out. Dizzy!